Hi everyone, Maria here. Today I'll be talking to you about accelerating the Delft Scalbraith algorithm with fast subfield root detection. This is based on joint work with Craig Costello and Giaxi. The general supersingular isogeny problem is the foundational problem in isogeny based cryptography, and it's believed to be secure against both classical and quantum computers. Given two supersingular elliptic curves defined over fp squared, it asks us to find an isogeny between them. Note that we do not assume the knowledge of any torsion points or that we know the degree of the isogeny. This makes the problem substantially easier, as shown independently by Kastrick and DeCruy and Maino and Martindale in their recent papers giving polynomial attacks against the key exchange SIDH or the encryption scheme PSYCH. So here we're really just considering a, the general isogeny problem where all we know is that we have two elliptic curves defined over FP squared and we want to find an isogeny between them. We can convert the isogeny problem to a pathfinding problem in the isogeny graph. Here, the nodes are elliptic curves, which we label with the J invariant, which lies in FP squared. The edges are then isogenies. So finding a path between two J invariants in this isogeny graph is equivalent to finding an isogeny uh, between the two elliptic curves labeled by the strain invariant. In the isogeny graph, there are two types of nodes, those lying in FP squared and those lying in FP. Gels and Galbraith's key idea was that finding paths between the FP nodes is comparatively easy so the bottleneck step of finding isogenies between these two J invariants is really walking in the graph um, until you hit a node defined over FP. Because once you find a path from your start and end node to nodes defined over FP, then you can navigate in the FP subgraph, which is a lot easier. In Solver, uh, we implement an optimized delft scalbraith algorithm and determine its concrete complexity. This is really important for determining concrete parameters for schemes whose best attack is the delft scalbraith algorithm, such as the soundness of a recent isogeny-based signature scheme, SkiSign. Building on this, we present SuperSolver with superpower fast subfield root detection. This allows us to scan a larger proportion of the graph at each step, therefore minimizing the number of FP operations per node revealed in the graph. In this way, we can cover a larger proportion of the graph while still minimizing uh, the number of FP operations. In doing so, we provide the best algorithm for finding paths to the FP subgraph. And we decrease the concrete complexity of the Dell Scalbraith algorithm. This affects schemes such as Ski Sign, an isogeny based signature scheme, and B Side, an isogeny based key exchange. For more details, please come to the full talk on Wednesday. Thank you.